Yo, 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 what's up, Warriors and Wahines? You rocking with your boy Ryan Grice Mullins, and this is Mullin' Around. Check me out. Yo, man, it's your boy Ryan Grice Mullins, man. I'm back with my boy Nick Costello, the libero. You know what it is, man, for your UH Warriors, man, volleyball team. So, but, um, you know, before we get started, man, I want to know what's up with the different colored jerseys, you feel me, during the games? Is it because, like, you're better than everybody else? Or is it because they get a jersey to the shortest person on the on the court? <laughs> I mean, I don't know, man. Just you know, just tell me and the people at home, you know, what's up with the jersey? Um, I don't know. I mean, so far in the league, it proves to be the shortest guy on the team gets the shirt. But I don't know. Just that's just how the rule is. You want to put your best passer and uh, defender out there, and the way you identify him is put in a different color jersey. Okay, so. okay, sweet, sweet. I like it. Well, now I know. Now y'all know. That's what it is. If you guys had to wear them little spandex like the women's volleyball team do, uh, do would you still play? I don't know about that one. <laughs> I, I'd have to get some extra larges and make sure they pull down quite well. But uh, yeah, I don't know. I mean, I don't think I could do that, to hey. be honest. Okay. Might, might have to go to basketball or something. <laughs> hey, I, hey I, I feel that because, man, I don't know if I could play. I might have to switch sports too. What's the kind of songs you listen to in your, like, pregame, you know, in your iPod before the games and everything? Um, I don't know. It varies uh, depending on who I'm feeling that day. But uh, lately, I've just been listening to some, just some Melson songs of Soldier. Okay. And uh, they just had a new album come out, so I've just been listening to that a lot and just, you know, find some peace of mind before the game. Uh, vibing, and vibing. Go battle, you go battle. So. Vibing, I like Stop. it. You know, me being a football player and all that, and, you know, when we score a touchdown, we able to do dance, dances and all that. So if y'all was able to, after scoring a point, you know, do a dance or whatever, what would be your dance? You got a little moves for the, for the people at home, no, you know? No, no, I, I, I definitely have to choreograph something with my teammates, yeah. but... Uh, I don't know, bro. I don't know if I could show. I, I can't see it right now. I got. I got to perfect it, and then I'll show you guys. But no sneak peeks. All right, no sneak peeks. You heard it first. You know, I'm the type of the guy that I got a couple pregame rituals myself. You know, I'm a left shoe, right shoe type of person. Oh, yeah. Left wristband, right wristband type of person. Uh, what about you? Any any rituals you have? Um, well, shoes. I just put them on. I don't really remember which ones I put on first, but it's always just socks, knee pads, uh, or knee sleeve, knee pads. And then after that, I go to tape my fingers. Okay. I don't know, I just can't tape before I put on my shoes and stuff. Hey, hey I, I feel that, I feel that. So, last question, last but not least, man. If you was Tom Hanks from Castaway, stranded on the island, what would you name your volleyball? Ooh. Well, Wilson's too original, so... I think I'd name that thing Mufasa. Mufasa. That'd be a cool name to talk hey, to you all day, you know? Hey, you know I like it. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. I have to get dressed like you too. Hey, so that. hey man, dread up, man. Hey, I'm telling you, dread up. That's the way to go. Everybody come out and watch your UH Warriors, man, volleyball team. Take it all this year. We out. Oh! That's the one. Hey, that could be a win in the video.